Okay, I'm getting ready to polish the lenses on my car here. And uh, in the viewfinder, it doesn't look too bad. It does. This one looks actually pretty good. I did the polish on it a few years back, but it is hazy, especially right here. It's kind of hazy, so I'll clean that up. Yeah, clean this up a little bit too. But this one is pretty bad. Let's see here. Yeah, you can really see it's hazy right here. It it looks more clear in the viewfinder than with the naked eye, but. When I turn my lights on at night, it's just really, really diffused, and I really don't get a good beam onto the road, so I'm going to clean this side up. So um, I'm going to do this side first. I won't show that on video, but I will show me doing this side and show you the after effects, and I'll take some before and after pictures. First, I'm just going to wipe it with some denatured alcohol. And you can get this at a hardware store like Lowe's or Home Depot and look in the paint department. I remember a while ago, uh, I was trying to find this at like a pharmacy or something because it was alcohol. And um, yeah, you don't want to buy it from a pharmacy. You want to go to a hardware store. It's in the paint department. So let's clean this up. And it's going to look a lot better just by wiping it because there is like a wax on it. So what I'm doing is I'm removing all the wax. And it's hazy because I'm reconstituting a lot of that wax. Now the front of it doesn't look too bad. It looks really clear. But I like to clean up the sides here over here what I'm using is this kit you can get from Amazon I think there's like 12 bucks polishing kit and it's just the foam pads it comes with two spindles that screw on to these polishing things um, I don't know what you call them discs and then there's different pads that are just velcroed on and I'm going to start some dried up polishing compound. Yeah. It's just, uh, I think it's like clay or something like that. But I'm just going to just kind of rub it on there just to get it. I don't know. But the secret ingredient is mother's polish. My brother told me that he watched some video where they use mother's polish and here's some pictures before and pictures before and after pictures of my mother's car using mother's polish her headlights What I might do is I'll put some mother's polish like that It's in this polishing compound. Alright, this seems to kind of work. Alright, here we go. Well, that looks much better already. So, it's still kind of hazy right here. So I'm going to polish this up some more, and then I'll come back. I'm going to come back and put some uh, clear coat on it. All right. That's about as good as that one's going to get. There's still a bit of haziness here, but I think once I put the clear coat on it, it'll be all right. But this looks really clear. You can see the reflectors on the reflector. <laughs> and, yeah better this one turned out really good here yeah you can see the reflector really clearly in there 
and this side is really I, I wonder why it's real clear here but as it starts to taper off this way I'm wondering if the heat because this is the low beam I wonder if the heat is causing it to degrade faster I don't know but so I'm gonna wash the car and then after I wash it I'll dry it real good and then put the uh, clear coat on it okay I prepped it cleaned it I wiped it with denatured alcohol and made sure it was nice and dry and this is a product that Scotty Kilmer recommended headlight coating I got another can I did this before on my other cars but I didn't do it on this car yet so there's a little bit left in here you want to mask it and you don't want to over spray on your car so keep an eye on this area here where it's still hazy Okay, here we go. Man, that's beautiful. Got a few drips. Apparently I got a little too close, but right there, there's no more haziness. I'll let that dry. I'll do the other side. There's a little bit of orange peeling, but I'm not a professional car painter. But that looks amazing. All right, kind of tight quarters in here, but. Yeah, that's not bad at all. Right before your eyes, it cleared up. All right. I am very happy with that. There you have it. You want to restore your plastic headlamp covers. You want to use mother's polish with a little polishing compound or, or anyway, some mild abrasive. Maybe even a little um, baking soda with the mother's polish and then use some of this McGuire's headlamp headlight coating I'm gonna put another coating but it's not gonna look much much different than this so there you go there's the end result hope that helps somebody later that deserves a little cowbell cowbell bump